Colorado taking action now to help support firefighters this summer. We could have our own fleet of helicopters, but the budget still needs to be approved. 7 News reporter Russell Haythorn live at the state capitol where lawmakers want our own helicopters on hand, Russell, to put in service right away this year. Mike, specifically three helicopters this year, four planes next year. That's the plan if a new law passes here at the state capitol this year, which, which would essentially allow the state of Colorado to go out and lease its own firefighting aircraft. This legislation comes on the heels of the massive Black Forest fire last June, the most destructive wildfire in state history. It is a clear and present danger and we need to address it. Senator Steve King is the sponsor of the legislation that would allow Colorado to purchase or lease three firefighting helicopters this year. We are one lightning strike, one match strike, one arsonist or terrorist match strike away from a catastrophic fire. Right now, Colorado is dependent on one of nine air tankers the U.S. government has for fighting fires. If the bill passes, Colorado, like California, would have its own fleet. In Colorado, it would be up to four large air tankers next year, in addition to the three helicopters this year. King says in the case of the Black Forest fire, it was three days before the state received heavy air support. The federal government isn't going to fly in and save us. California isn't going to fly in and save us. We need to save ourselves. And this bill already has bipartisan support, including Democratic sponsorship. The cost of leasing the three helicopters this year would be anywhere from eight to $12 million, we're told. A bill that passed last year already allows Colorado to create its own firefighting air corps but this bill this year actually provides the money to make it happen. Live at the state capitol, Russell Haythorn, 7 News.